I'm Leanne Brownson. I have a home decorating business. But I'm here to show you some few tips on decluttering. I have a seven step decluttering system and Elena Williams here has kindly donated her pantry. <laughs> yes. To show you. We're going to have lots of fun. <laughs> so Elena, <laughs> now we've got this pantry so you have to look and decide what you want uses for, I can see here, looking at the moment, that these are quite good. Tall oil, um, soya bottles, big bits, containers, things. There's a container up there that's not this one here, obviously doesn't go here. Oh God. <laughs> so, yeah, and then the different levels, this is quite good for spices and things. Also, we've got the pre-prepared, very good items, things you can put in in the pantry, put it out and reorganise or put it out when you need to use it. And we can sectionalise your herbs and things for different recipes. I know you did all your lovely cooking. <laughs> so let's get started. <laughs> Hi, so we've decluttered this cabinet, this um, pantry, and it's looking a lot better. There's still the top bit to just rearrange and have a look, but I think it um, looks like like a, bit, a little bit of space and you can see what you've got there so you're not going to overspend and buy it again so that's really good things that we've organized and there's always room for more organizing but it's great to have a really good start and it does get quite addictive and once you get into different other places you'll be able to find homes for things and move things out and you'll feel a lot a lot better in your mind as well so you don't have all this clutter around and you can function in a really good way Thank you. Thank you very much. So now we have vinegars and oils in here. And we have cereals all in here in one space. Here we have teas. I am a tea holic. And also we have uh, some of the things for baking. And here it is um, my vast collection of spices. And there are little containers uh, of uh, different flowers. I have lots of fancy flowers including buckwheat and almond and all sorts of things. And this is our little container for teas and coffees to use often. And this is some storage for dry products. And there's a canned food that I use quite often. And there's some space. Wow. Well done.